Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel and Merry Christmas. Today, I'm gonna to show you guys how to make a delicious eggnog recipe. I'm pretty much gonna be sticking to the basics of eggnog preparation and ingredients and flavors and things like that. Um, so it's not gonna to be too different than what you guys are used to, um, but of course, I'm gonna put my own little spin on it, a couple different flavor profiles and uh, little garnishing techniques and things like that. So hopefully you guys enjoy and let's get in the kitchen making some eggnog. All right, so first up is making the eggnog. So in a small sauce pot, you're gonna add some milk and cream. Uh, then you're gonna add a vanilla pod and some ground nutmeg for flavor, uh, followed by some brown sugar to sweeten it all up. And of course, some egg yolks to give it that rich texture that we all look for in eggnog. Once you put all the ingredients into the sauce pot, give it a good mix and then you're going to bring this up to about 180 degrees Fahrenheit or until it coats the back of a spoon and then you're going to pour it into a container and chill it in the fridge for about an hour and a half. Alright, so while the eggnog is chilling in the fridge, I'm just going to simply garnish the glass uh, with some brushed maple syrup around the rim, and then I'm going to dip it in some ground graham crackers that I bought from the store and just threw into a Roboku. Um, also, I'm going to whip up some cream uh, with a little bit of dark rum and brown sugar, and then uh, top it all off with that uh, spiked whipped cream at the end, and it's going to be just a beautiful eggnog recipe for any holiday dinner. Delicious little looking beverage. Rachel's laughing at me. This looks good. Looks nice. Delish. Looks like all you can see all the little spices and little nutmeg in there. Top with the uh, spiked whipped cream. Give this guy a try. Mm. It's definitely Christmas. I want some of this cream. Mmm. Yes. Ooh, that is good. Ooh, that's like the adult version. Delicioso. I gotta have another sip. The whipped cream is my favorite part. You could probably under whip the whipped cream just a little bit so it falls um, sort of flat on the eggnog. It's not so stiff. I over whipped it just a little bit, but it's all right. All in all, this is just a killer eggnog recipe. Very, very good. I recommend it for the holidays. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you did. Comment below, subscribe, thumbs up, and uh, I'll see you guys next time with some more delicious recipes. Bye, everybody, and Merry Christmas.